You've likely heard the saying, not your keys, not your coins. But since wallet addresses are generated randomly, doesn't this mean that there's a chance that someone generates the same address and private key as you? Before that though, a quick refresher on private keys. A private key is a long string of alphanumeric characters that is generated alongside a blockchain address. This key is needed to access and approve transfers of funds for that particular address. Private keys are different from seed phrases. Imagine an address as a mailbox that requires a private key to unlock. Meanwhile, a seed phrase is like having a bunch of private keys that allow you to unlock a collection of mailboxes. Since wallet addresses and their respective private keys are generated at random, there is a slight chance that someone could generate the same address and private key as you. But how likely is it? On Bitcoin, the total number of possible wallet addresses is 2 to the power of 160. This means the odds of someone generating the same private key as yours is 1 in 1.4 quindecillion, or 14 with 47 zeros after it. But practically speaking, one won't need to go through all the possible addresses to find the right one. Just checking half of all the possible addresses, or 2 to the power of 80 addresses, would yield a 50% probability of running into your address. However, even if someone has a hypercomputer generating a billion addresses per hour, it would still take them 137 quadrillion, or 137 million billion years, just to get a 50% chance of bumping into your address. Even if this person wins this astronomically long coin flip, it won't happen in yours or your great-great-grandchild's lifetime. Okay, perhaps someone else generating your private key out of all the possible addresses is out of the question. But what if we simply generate a private key that controls any address with funds in it? Well, according to a blog post by Chainalysis in 2018, there are only 172 million addresses with the potential of holding funds. But wait, out of these 172 million addresses, 147 million of them belong to services such as exchanges, businesses, and merchants. Addresses belonging to these entities would likely be multi-signature wallet addresses, which require multiple private keys to unlock. This leaves us with only 25 million addresses belonging to individuals holding Bitcoin. As mentioned earlier, there are 2 to the power of 160 or over 1.4 quindecillion possible wallet addresses. Even with 25 million funded addresses, the odds of generating a private key to any of these wallets, while more likely, is still 1 in 5.8 no nillion. Let's bring back the hypercomputer we used in our earlier scenario. Assuming we go through a billion addresses an hour, it would still take us a ridiculous 667 quadrillion years to land on any of these addresses. That's 48 million times the age of the universe, which is hypothesized to be 13.8 billion years old. And this isn't even accounting for the massive power, hardware costs, and storage space needed to run this operation in the first place. So with all of this, it's safe to say that the 100 BTC jackpot contained in Satoshi's most famous wallet address is sadly out of our hands. Fortunately for us, the coins in our Bitcoin wallet are also probabilistically out of anybody else's hands. But as quantum computers become more viable day by day, should we be worried about the safety of blockchains? Click on this video to find out.